What's going on, everyone? ChristianPickDogs.com here with your free pick in the Denver Broncos versus New England Patriots NFL matchup going down Sunday, December 24th, 2023. Just a reminder, if you haven't already, make sure you're subscribed to our channel and smash that thumbs up. And if you're looking for my best bets, the games I love the most, including my daily $19 best bet, make sure that you head on over to PickDogs.com and click the Premium Picks tab at the top of the page. But let's get to this one between the... New England Patriots and the Denver Broncos coming to us from mile high as you've got uh, the Denver Broncos coming in 7-7 seven and seven on the year, 5-8-1 and one against the number this season. After a 42-17 loss at the hands of the Detroit Lions in their last matchup, meanwhile, New England coming in off a 27-17 loss to the Kansas City Chiefs in their last matchup. Back-to-back -back covers for New England, but uh, still just 1-1 one one again, uh, excuse me, 1-1 one one straight up in those two games, and I honestly think we're at a point now where every win hurts New England more than it helps them. I mean, they're eliminated from playoff contention. They should really only be focusing on uh, on their draft pick at this point. Um, and just trying to make sure that it's the best that it could possibly be so they can start building again for the future. And um, like I said, any win will, will, will hinder that. And that's why I'm trying to figure out who the, who the quarterback is going to be. It looks like it's still going to be Bailey Zappi. It looks like Mac Jones is going to be you know benched once again here. I don't know. I'm 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 torn as a Patriots fan. I'm torn because I want to see Mac Jones play so that, um, you know, so that he gives us the best shot at, at you know getting a high draft pick. But on the other side of the coin, Bailey Zappi's been performing well, and maybe we give him some reps to see what he's got going into next season. Um, so again, I'm kind of torn here. But the Denver Broncos on the other side, you know, they're the only team with any sort of playoff aspiration coming into this game. Anything you know with, with anything of consequence to play for at this point, you know, mainly considering that. You know, this nice little run they've been on has pushed them back into the playoff hunt. Now, two losses in their last three games is going to help, considering that, you know, right now they're on the outside looking in at 7-7, seven and seven, while a lot of the teams ahead of them are either 8-7 and seven or 8-6. and six. Um, But again, a win here pushes them sort of back into that log jam. And really, those the 8-7 and seven teams and 8-6 and six teams, there's five of them, and not including the Denver Broncos, who if they win here would improve to 8-7 and seven and make it at 6, all fighting for one playoff spot right now. Some teams are trying to jostle for position in the division, but again, that's pretty much where it's at right now. And I think that the Denver Broncos are just the, the, the team that is in a better position to fight for something here. Um, like I said, the New England Patriots, they've, they've put up admirable fights. Like I said, they beat the, uh, the Pittsburgh Steelers and they hung around with, with uh, Kansas City. But this is still a New England offense that's 28th in total offense, 25th in yards per carry. You know, New, Denver's defense hasn't been great on the season, but... That includes those performances where they gave up like 70 to the Dolphins and stuff like that. In the last, you know, three games, it's been better. You know, they're around league average in terms of rushing yards allowed per game. The 24th against the pass, but against the New England pass offense, the flat out stinks. So I think Denver does enough to win this one by 10 points, maybe 24 to 14, 27, 17, something like that. So I'm going to take the Denver Broncos here. I'm going to lay the seven and a half with Denver. That's going to be my free pick. But just a reminder, if you haven't already, make sure you subscribe to our channel and smash that thumbs up. And if you're looking for my best bets, you can find those at Pick Dogs Premium. While you're at Pick Dogs, check out our betting tools. They're 100% free. They're the best betting tools in the business and tools that you want to make sure that you have in your back pocket when you're making your best bets for the day's action. And while you're at our YouTube channel, make sure you have notifications turned on so you can be the first to be in the know when the newest content drops here at Pick Dogs. Thanks for watching. See you guys soon.